interesting. A little bit of history. I don't recall the exact date, but the hotel was constructed in the early part of the, the 70s as a timeshare resort. And I think two years after construction started, the company went bust. So this is what we are left with. That's what, 50 years ago? Wow. And apparently, parts of it have fallen into the sea. And people have even died here. So many years after the original construction, a development company was found that took ownership and they were instructed to put four meter fence around the site. Imagine this if it was finished. It would have been amazing. See, there's two staircases here. I wonder if we can see all the way up. Wow, we can. That's amazing. I think if somebody had an FPV drone, they would have a fantastic time here. I think this is, or was, the lift shaft. See how high that goes up. Wow. I think it would have been fantastic to see this finished. It's a real shame. It's not the only one, there's plenty of uh, abandoned constructions on the island. And back then they all seemed to have gone for this concrete with tiny windows design. I don't understand why. One just down the road from where I live, and <laughs> it gets gets referred to locally as the prison because it looks like a prison. It's just really small slats for windows. So there we have it, the Anyaza Hotel, Zanya, Anyaza Hotel. Just imagine that finished. Glory.